databases, it's common to use a database administration tool. It can be very tedious to administer a database through command lines using terminal. A popular tool designed for this purpose is PHP MyAdmin. This free tool allows us to administer our database through a graphical user interface, or GUI. At the same time, it preserves the ability to directly execute SQL statements to our database. PHP MyAdmin offers many commonly used administrative operations. This includes the ability to create, delete, and modify databases, tables, columns, relations, indexes, users, and permissions. We can also do many other tasks, including importing data from CSV and SQL, exporting data in various formats, creating graphical layouts of our database structures. This list is not exhaustive and the tool provides many other features as well. Since PHP MyAdmin is an open source tool, it's very popular in the web development community. There's a wide range of documentation and support available for it. If you're taking this course as part of the web development masterclass, you don't have to worry about installing PHP MyAdmin. It comes standard with our installation of WAMP or MAMP if you're using a Mac. We've also already installed it on our live testing server as part of one of the packages we configured during setup in a previous section. To access PHP MyAdmin on your local computer, Click on the WAMP or MAMP icon. Uh, make sure the server is running, so the icon should be green. From the menu, select PHP MyAdmin. And once you do that, you'll see that PHP MyAdmin launches in your web browser. Another way of accessing PHP MyAdmin is typing in this address, localhost slash PHP MyAdmin and it'll take you to the same admin area.